Hack or treat! Greetings from the Hackerbox's headquarters. What we have here today is Hackerbox number 0011. We're going to be looking at some uh, fun motion detection technology and uh, also wireless signaling between multiple microprocessor nodes. We have this fun holiday theme and these uh, box items we have will allow us to create some pranks and tricks and treats, uh, including some really fun uh, animatronics. So thank you for joining us. Our topics and learning objectives for Hackerbox number 0011 include setting up multiple battery-powered microcontroller nodes, loading and modifying programs in the Arduino IDE, using passive infrared motion detectors, transmitting and receiving wireless messages, implementing wireless communication network topologies, using servo motors and LEDs to create simple animatronics, and accessing USB storage devices from your microcontroller projects. Great, so let's see what exactly we have in this uh, hacker box number 0011. There is a hacker treat decal. Uh, we have a two channel relay module. Um, there's a, a USB drive a read write module based on the uh, CH376S chip. Uh, this module will let you read and write um, USB drives, hard drives, flash drives, and, and such. There is a set of 10 mini PCB addressable LEDs. These are full color RGB LEDs based on the WS2812 component. Uh, let's see, we have a four gigabyte USB drive that is a skeleton that loses its own head. It's horrifying, uh, perfect for the holiday season. Uh, there is a pair of uh, 315 megahertz radio frequency data transmitters and a matching pair of 315 megahertz radio frequency data receivers. All right, so we also have three Arduino Pro Mini modules. So these are the uh, 5 volt 16 megahertz uh, variety of the, of the Pro Minis. And so the reason why we have three of these is because we're going to be working with wireless signaling between microcontroller nodes. So... Um, having three and then uh, two sets of uh, RF uh, links that we could set up will allow us to uh, try different um, topologies of wireless communications between processor nodes. Uh, we also have a USB serial module based on the CH340 chip that can be used to program the Arduino Pro Mini modules. There's um, three 9-volt battery clips here that can power the uh, Pro Mini modules from a simple 9-volt battery. Um, we have a small 5 centimeter uh, 8 ohm speaker and a 3.5 millimeter audio output jack. So both of those can be used for, you know, directly outputting audio or uh, providing a, a stereo output, audio output jack for plugging in headphones or amplified speakers. Uh, in the box, there's also a passive infrared motion detector, uh, a couple of uh, piezo buzzers, a micro servo, um, some female to female uh, DuPont uh, jumper wires, and uh, a couple of um, Maxim 7219 uh, dr uh, driven 8x8 LED um, matrices that can be used to make some really uh, horrifying Halloween eyes. And uh, we have an exclusive uh, Hackerbox's Bithead lapel pin, and it's a it's a, a polished silver finish with black enamel. It's a, it looks pretty uh, pretty spiffy there. Great. So we've set up a couple of motion activated radio controlled um, animatrons here as examples of uh, some of the things we could do with the items in this box. Check these guys out. Whoa, now that's a hacker treat. 
So we had a great time setting up these demos and we hope you also really enjoy working on everything that's in this box and the projects we have set up for you. Uh, we also hope you learn a thing or two and think outside the box and try to build something else. We look forward to seeing what you come up with. And if you are not currently a Hackerboxes subscriber, please check out our website at hackerboxes.com. From there, you can see all of our past boxes. You can take a look at what we've been up to and what you've been missing out on. We also have our hacker school there where you can take a look at all of the detailed information and instructions that go with everything in this box and all of our past boxes. If you like what you see, please join us and subscribe to Hackerboxes.